coming to town. Santa! Oh my god! So I'm back with another skincare product review But before we get into that If you are new to my channel Please hit the subscribe button And hit the bell to be notified when I upload a new video So that you don't miss out on any content And also if you are a returning subscriber I do thank you for all of your continued support and love And just for always watching my videos You guys, you do not go unnoticed Alright, so the product that I am talking about today Is the Collagen Hydrogel gold mask now i have not used this brand before but i do use a lot of sheet mats in my skin routine just because i feel like on saturdays on the days on well i'll say saturday or sunday whichever is your lazy day when you're at home you do need to just get into the routine of developing yourself a weekend skincare routine and i say a weekend skincare routine because there needs to be that one day on the weekend where you put more effort into your skin than you do throughout the week because sometimes throughout the week we have a good cleansing process but on the weekends we do need to take that extra time to at least do some type of mask to just deep cleanse our face and do an extra 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 good moisturizing routine so so, this product, again, is the Hydrogel Gold Mask. This can be picked up at your local Walmart. I believe it was $2.50 or $3. Um, and it says it is for all skin types. It comes in two pieces for one use. And it's just for skin tightening, elastic, elasticity, and it is loaded with collagen and gold and will help you hydrate and revitalize dull, fatigued skin while detoxifying the impurities in the skin to give an overall glow and life to the skin. Alright, so on the back, it just tells you what to do. And basically, you know, once again, just to reiterate, it does help with blood circulation, minimizing your pores, and diminishing fine lines and wrinkles. A lot of us that wear a lot of makeup, some of us wear makeup to minimize our pores, and some of us use a lot of primer, more than one primer, because we have that problem with pores. If you develop a good skincare routine, you can minimize that yourself without having to overdo your makeup and priming. Um, you just have to find things that work for you. All right, so with the directions, it tells you first start off, you wash your face to remove any makeup, which I've already done. And you just basically place it around your mouth and adjust to the opening. You relax for 20 minutes with the mask in your place, and then you remove it and discard. It says no need to rinse it. You can massage the remaining product that's left on your face into your skin, and it will be absorbed, and you don't have to rinse your face at all. So we're just going to go ahead and cut this open and dive right into it. All right, so I'll cut it open. I want you guys to see what it looks like when it comes out of the package. It is very, very slimy. Very slimy. The ones that I'm used to, they're more of a thin sheet mask material. This is like very goopy, if you guys can see this. There's really no way to just completely pull this out with keeping the mask together. You're going to have to pull it all out. Oh, and it's falling already. I'm not happy, you guys. So, I might just stick with my regular mask. Because this is already falling apart. No, this is not going to cut it. So, you guys, I'm not even going to be able to review this product for you. Which I'm glad I opened this up on camera. Because I want to show you guys what it looked like when it came out of the package. And this is another reason, you know... <sighs> It's good that people open products for you and review them. First of all, this, this is no good. If your product comes out of your packaging like this, this is absolutely no good. It's already ripped, torn. It is way too much oil on this mask, which is the reason that it's ripped. If you guys can see this, how if you can see it around my fingers. And this is the part that was supposed to go around your eyes. I'm trying to get it where you can see it. See how it's already ripped and falling? That's a no-go. See the little pieces that fell with it? No. And I'm guessing this is the piece that was supposed to enclose it around your mouth. And this is exactly how it came inside of the packaging. And yeah, it's all stuck together. 
yeah this was supposed to go around the bottom of your face so I'm gonna wipe my hands before I touch anything so just off gate you guys I can't even give you a full review on this product I'm just gonna have to rate it a complete fail to be honest with you this was a complete fail one because I couldn't even try the product out it's it's bad when you can't even try this is the rest of the packaging that was in there and you can see there's nothing on the because all of the mask was clumped together on that one sheet like whoever packaged this together this was absolutely horrible I'm just gonna give you a straight zero will I purchase it again to see if all of them are packaged like this no even though it was two dollars I'm still gonna tell people not to go out and buy it just because you get one opportunity when you review products and this opportunity was an absolute fail so this was made by the company masculology and again i got this from walmart no i'll stick with my regular gold sheet mask that you get from sephora this i will not purchase again this is absolutely not constructed well i can't even tell you how it feels on my face i mean i have a little bit of the gel on my hands but it's not even enough for me to tell you how it's going to feel against your skin it's just do I think that it's going to work and help blood circulation? No, because it wasn't even tight enough to stay on the packaging inside of the slip that they sent. So how can it help improve your face if it can't even stay inside of the package? This was a fail. I think they need to try again. I think that might be why it's inside of Walmart for $2 because it can't stand up to the other gold mask. This was an absolute fail. No, I will not buy it again. Sorry I couldn't try it for you guys, but I'm glad that I opened it up on camera for you guys to see it. So... I'll see you guys later.